once a minion dies, I can actually just select a blue card and get my mana back without having to actually waste mana from picking that card. Using this kind of technique, I can build a CS lead without having to even attack the enemy at all. Now finally, after you've actually executed your trade, you should immediately retreat so that your opponent can't retaliate on you and you reduce the amount of minion damage that you take. So now I'll show you some examples of using the trading stance in mid lane, but with less frequency in the melee versus range matchup. This is because you're susceptible to enemy auto attack harass, and you're probably going to be at a health disadvantage for the majority of the early lane games. So, the trading stance in a melee versus range matchup is merely just a matter of standing on the dying minion and using your reach ability. Now, almost every melee laner has some kind of reach ability. Think of Darius E and Q, or Fizz Q and Ulti, or Jax W Q into stun, or I rally a dash to a minion and E them. Something like that. So, since you're melee, you have to be much more vigilant of taking minion damage. But the